Hello YouTube and welcome to another episode of Let's Learn the Mods. Today we're going to be covering um, uh, the automatic um, production of uranium from uranium ore. Uh, to get started, all of these have export buses on the top. We designate um, uranium ore to be pulled in a macerator. The result of this would be crushed uranium, which um, is then pulled into here, and this processes, and then um, the result would be purified crushed uranium which is pulled into here. Currently we have fuel rods, um, depleted fuel rods being produced. I'll explain what those are for in a bit. Um, but it'll pull both of those in. And then we have the automatic canning machine, which will pull um, enriched uranium and an empty fuel rod in. Um, and that'll can it so it can be used in the nuclear reactor. We have import buses all along the bottom. They're all blank. Um, they'll just automatically pull in everything. I just have them set to single or stack. It doesn't really matter what um, stack is just faster. Um, back here we have our um, cables colored so they don't connect. Um, over here is red and here is orange. Um, if they're both painted orange they would connect. If they're different colors they will not connect. That's for if you don't want cables to connect. Alright, um, over here you should see that we have um, uranium as well as not any tiny piles of uranium because this is processing, so let's just get some tiny piles of uranium. Alright, there we go. Then you just run it like that, get your enriched uranium fuel, just toss it in there, and that'll automatically process it. Um, another thing to notice, if you're going to be working with uranium, please wear a scuba helmet and hazmat suit and leggings as well as rubber boots. You'll take some ridiculous damage if um, if you're not wearing those. Uranium ore on its own doesn't really matter um, if you hold that, but anything beyond that, like um, crushed uranium ore, as well as purified and so on, um, those actually hurt. Or, you know what? I, I don't know. These two might be fine, but um, I do know for sure enriched uranium is very bad for you. Also, at the end of each um, nuclear reactor cycle, you get these... Um, deplete fuel rods and those yield tiny piles of plutonium. Eventually you can take nine and combine it into a full pile of plutonium and then eventually a pellet of RTG fuel. Um, you can actually get a total of 32 EU per tick if you have five of these in a radioisotope thermoelectric generator. So that's, um, that's some pretty easy free power and this will last forever. Um, it'll never go away. Yeah, please turn off. Alright, and that pretty much covers um, what I was planning to cover in this video, uh, and the rain refuses to turn off. Alright, so I hope um, you all enjoyed this video, and I hope you all have a good day. See you later.